What's up guys, it's Greeny, and uh, starting uh, my second week of my week in food. It's Monday, and I'm gonna have my first meal here at Central Festival Mall. Central Festival Mall, the top two floors here are all restaurants, and I gotta say, it's probably 75% Japanese and Korean restaurants for some reason, I'm not sure. But uh, if you want ramen, this is a good place to come, so let's check it out. All right, so I'm here at Oishi Ramen. I think there's another Oishi place too, but uh, just getting the shoyu. I think I get the same thing every time, either the miso or the shoyu ramen, so. After my ramen, I headed down to the basement, the bottom floor of Central Festival. And there's all kinds of vendors, food courts, that type of stuff down there. But there's this lady that makes these little waffles. One was stuffed with bananas. The other one had chocolate on top. And they're 10 baht a piece. So 20 baht, basically about 70 cents for both of these. Okay, it's Monday night for dinner. I'm going here to my place. No, the place. So first course here is a little salad, and I also ordered some hummus with beef. Some pita bread, they brought me this sauce, said it's gonna be spicy. So, check it out. I think I'm gonna wait for my meat and hummus before I eat. All right, here it is, hummus with beef. A little salad, some pita bread. I'll make some little sandwiches. Let me try this first though. Good. Mm. Good flavor. I like it. Beef looks a little spicy. It's not, uh, but it does it is seasoned well? Obviously, hummus. I love hummus. So, time to dig in. All right, guys. It's uh, Tuesday night, and I'm back at Cheap Charlie's Ooh. having some Penang chicken. Just some rice. There, there's Charlie right there. So, this right here is the chicken fajitas at the Robin Hood. It was so good last week, I came back to have another meal here. All right, back at Cheap Charlie's for the uh, breakfast special there. It's on me about orange juice, coffee. Toast, 89 baht, so three dollars for all this. Thursday night, and I finally went to a place I've been wanting to go to called Punch and Judy. It's uh, like Italian and English food, and it's very affordable. I couldn't believe uh, how nice of a place it was and how low the prices were for some of these meals. I got the beef tortellini, which was uh, 180 baht, but I noticed that uh, like a salmon steak was only 250 baht on the menu, which is like just dirt cheap. I mean, you go to some, like in Bangkok, you might pay 100 for a salmon steak, but uh, it was pretty good stuff. Here I am getting ready to try this tortellini. And I think there was an issue with the, uh, like a copyright, a song in the background. So that's why I'm voiceovering. But uh, it was real creamy cheese, a little bit of ham inside and uh, had the bolognese sauce on the outside. It was really good and such a great deal there. I'll definitely be hitting this place again. So I'm back at Salt in Zhongtian. And I got these uh, pork 
thick things. And I wanted to show you guys the view here. I forgot to show it in the last video. This is why I like this place, because this is the view. Saturday for lunch, I decided to just walk over to uh, this mall that's next to the Avani Resort. I'm not sure if that's the name of the mall too or not, but the, you can see the Ripley's, believe it or not, is in there. But uh, one of my restaurants I like in there is Bon, I think it's Bon Chan. I don't know, I usually get chicken wings there, but today I was in the mood for a salad, so I got this. And let me tell you, it was really good. This dressing was awesome and also had a great view. Nice ambiance there. Saturday night, I went over to Kiss. It's on uh, Second Road. I think maybe like Soy 13, very close to where I live. And uh, it's a good Thai, good Thai restaurant. Ordered the uh, spring rolls and a couple more traditional Thai dishes. But uh, this is one of my go-tos for Thai food because it's so close. Nice place in walking distance. I believe that's the cashew chicken I got there. And it was pretty good. So over on Sukhumvit Road, there's so much stuff. I never come over here. Check this out. Texas chicken. I don't know. The pictures look damn good. What else? Some other coffee tea type place. This guy. Who is this guy? Anybody know this guy? Put in the comments. It's like food row over here. I'm gonna have to come out here more often. Pizza Hut, obviously can do without that. Black Canyon coffee. Right over there's Amazon coffee. This noodle shop, they got these uh, pink noodles, pink soup. There's pink tofu. That's something I haven't tried yet. I'm definitely gonna have to try that. Thai food. It's dim sum here. Check this place out. Having any dim sum since I've been over here in Patia. All right. All right, guys, it's time for the grand finale of the week here when it comes to my diet. And Google has this ranked as the number one pizza place in Patia, Dam. They give it 4.5 out of five which is the highest rate. So, I'm gonna judge for myself, but looks nice. You're on YouTube. this but they brought it a little bruschetta nice. little appetizer here noodle paki mao and it's uh pork some veggies like noodles they almost look like ramen noodles but uh i'm gonna let you guys know how it is i think it's gonna be a little spicy all right i just took out a pepper and with my finger and it was very hot Very spicy. This is all I'm gonna eat of it. Tastes good, but hot. I went for this margarita pizza and look at it. Looks pretty damn delicious. So, I'll let you know. So all of a sudden, a song started blaring in the background. Uh, so I had a voice over this, but uh, the pizza little uh not that well done on the bottom but wasn't very floppy at all 
had a really good flavor of sauce, a lot of tang to it, and uh, the cheese was the real deal, like mozzarella, maybe a mozzarella mix. Uh, basil had a nice kick on top, so it was tasted super fresh and was really good pizza. It's definitely gonna make the finals in my little pattaya pizza off. Eventually when I uh, try enough pizzas, I'll figure out what my top three are and do a little video on that. But uh, this is good stuff. I really enjoyed it. I'm not sure what it is with pies and ketchup, but I brought a date here to try the pizza and uh, ranked the best pizza in Puttia and she just smothered it with ketchup. Oh my God. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Again, I'll be doing a food video. I'll be releasing it every Monday. It'll be the previous uh, Monday through Sunday of what I ate or some of the things I ate. And uh, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. Cheers.